My name is Dave Kalavanskis, and I'm a shooting coach, and I'm working out here in Seattle. And I thought I'd take a little moment to show you guys uh, what we talk about uh, when we talk about squaring up. There's, most people know about squaring up from the lower part of the body. If you see right here on my feet, you're going to see that this is a, a legitimate square up. My feet are perfectly parallel to the line. Excuse my footwear, but. Uh, uh, at this time also, a lot of people line up like this, that's not really square, but that's really a, not that relevant to great shooting. So now, that's out of the picture. Now what we want to do is tell you about another square up uh, deal is when you, when you actually uh, put the ball on your hand, it's important that your hand is square. If I take the ball away, you'll notice that my thumb and pinky are parallel to the floor. They, when I turn it this way for the shot, I'm actually parallel and square all the way to the rim. That's very, very important. A lot of us are actually at an angle, uh, sideways before we even go to the beginning of the shot. Uh, so that's really not square. So that's, we got the square feet, we got the square hand, and now we want to make sure we square finish. When you finish to the basket after the release, the thumb and the pinky should be parallel to the floor. Index finger should be painted the center of the rim, and this way you've got this wrist going 90 degrees rather than any weird angles. And you, one more thing before you, uh, as you're going to work on this, make sure you never have any lateral movement. But we'll do that on another uh, on another clip. Thanks for tuning in.